Here's the main object. It's going to come over here. There will be a flash. It'll dart back here. Then you'll see a streak go through here. As radical as it sounds, Dr. Jack Kasher, who has worked on Star Wars defense development, believes we may be witnessing a Star Wars weapon being fired just before a UFO performs an evasive maneuver. Watch for a double flash down here, and then it'll zip off. There's the flash. There it goes. Here comes the streak right through where it had been. While NASA has maintained that this footage probably shows ice particles being affected by the shuttle's rockets, Kasher is certain this is not the case. He believes NASA's cameras caught extraterrestrial vehicles navigating over our planet. An ice particle simply cannot stop and wait for half a second and then react to being pushed by the exhaust from the uh, shuttle. I think the video itself is a landmark because of uh, the significance of what appears to be going on there and the fact that it appears that we really are looking at spacecraft out in space away from the shuttle. I studied it extensively over maybe a two-year period at least. University of Nebraska physicist Jack Kasher worked for nearly 10 years in the research and development of a Star Wars defense system for the upper atmosphere. His quantitative analysis of the NASA footage concludes that the UFO cannot be explained as a natural phenomenon. It's clearly above the atmosphere and air glow of the Earth. It maneuvers, it changes direction, it accelerates, and so the only thing really left is spacecraft. Others think this object is simply a small ice particle floating a few feet from the shuttle. Ice particles are a common waste product of the numerous shuttles that have orbited Earth. But Kasha is convinced NASA has recorded strong evidence of a large, intelligently controlled alien space vehicle. One of the very strange things that happens is that the main object actually stops and sits there for half a second before it accelerates back up to the right. Uh, an ice particle could not do that. If they're not junk, they're not satellites, they're not meteors because those objects don't change direction. The film that Don Ratch captured from NASA Select shows what it appears to show, then I think we have a strong indication that the extraterrestrials are visiting the Earth. And someone might be shooting at them, and if so, they are easily evading these very advanced weapons.